Hello YouTube, uh, the Tech Dude one two three zero here, and I am going to be doing an iOS five hidden feature video today. So let's just get right into it here. Uh, I recently have done a iOS five feature or iOS five uh, review uh, for the iPad, but I've done it for the iPod. I don't think I will do one for the iPod, but I'm gonna do some hidden features. So yeah, here we go. Uh, first one's on the lock screen. If you double click the home button. A little picture icon will pop up right down here. You can see it there. Hold on, let me get my better lens here. Oh, let me just click it, and then as you see right there, you get a little picture icon, and then you click it, and it opens up your camera app so you can take pictures or whatever. Um, next one is in the pictures app too. Uh, when you're in it and you're taking pictures, say I take a picture, I'll just take a picture of my desk here. Okay, so I just took it, and then it's there, and then maybe say I want to look at it again. Um, I just slide it over, and then there's the picture. Um, for some reason, there's a bug, so when you take a picture, it stays there. Um, so they need to fix that in iOS 5, I hope they do. Or I hope iOS 5 beta 3 so yeah that's nice so if you take a picture you just slide over and you go into your photos um next next is in the weather app oh do, 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 do. gotta find it not in there alright um so I'm in the weather's app and then say I want to look what it's gonna be hourly on Sunday. Uh, I'll just click, just click Sunday, in the drop-down bar of the uh, the day or the time and what it's gonna be. So four o'clock, it's supposed to have a forty percent chance of thunderstorms with eighty-eight degrees. So yeah, that's pretty. That's pretty nice and kind of fun to use. So you can see what the date and time or the hourly weather is um next one is going to be located in the settings now this was featured in my ipad uh... review or my ipad ios 5 review it is under general keyboard and then down here shortcuts you can add a new shortcut just do that and then now i'm going to put Hey, what's up? Up. And then H W U. And then save. And then there it'd be down there. So whenever you type, you can just type H W U W and then U. And then it'll change it to Hey, what's up? So that's pretty nice. Um, Next one. Let me find it here. We're going to go back into the cameras app. Um, so one, you can go into portrait mode with it. Let me get a different angle. We can go into a different portrait. or we can, Yeah, we can go into portrait mode. And we can use the camera like this. And then the volume rockers up here, you can use that as your camera. See, I just took a picture by just clicking the volume rocker. So yeah, that's kind of fun to use. Um, next one is uh, there's a new feature in the camera. Uh, if you look on top, there'd be a little options. You click it, and then you can turn on the grid. And what the grid does is it makes it so you can align the pictures and stuff. Like I want that in the middle, that you know, so you can like know where the pictures will be taken. Um, I think that's about it. Let me just run through it all again. Yeah, so that'll be it for today on iOS 5 Hidden Features. I will be doing another one when I, once I find some more hidden features. So please rate, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next vid.